With New York becoming the 17th state to regulate cannabis, it's time to look at some trends in the Big Apple. All coming up. Welcome back to The Talking Hedge. I'm Josh Kincaid, capital markets analyst and host of your cannabis business podcast. Look at some projections from headset on New York adult use cannabis sales potentially or projected to be $1.1 billion. New York's announcement comes pretty quick on the heels of New Jersey as well as Vermont, all happening right after the election uh, where five states were voted. So this is a pretty quick pace uh, to become 34% of all states now have uh, some form of a regulated cannabis. So New Jersey kind of creating that FOMO, helping uh, New York make that decision to get out of some debt. Um, some of the estimates are going to be maybe 15% lower than previously reported to around 740 million. New York um, obviously going to be generating some Cash, assuming that people kind of go back to New York at some point, there's somewhat of a mass exodus as people were going to Florida uh, and Texas and other places. But some estimates for New York tax revenue estimated around 350 million a year uh, with a planned 13% tax rate. So that's nine at the state level, four at the local level. So that means that there'd be a $3 billion a year market once that's fully implemented. So if we also estimate using Massachusetts as an example, since they both kind of had the same uh, markets, um, both functioning with medical and then moving into the rec market, we might see um, New York numbers being similar. So if we look at the end of Massachusetts first year of sales, there was 33 operational cannabis retailers. So New York currently has 10 operational marijuana, medical marijuana licenses which operate in a total of 38 dispensaries and two more coming soon. So these numbers could be conservative as well because New York with their, their population um, is going to bring in more than New Jersey, more than Massachusetts. But this these numbers don't actually include tourism, which I kind of find uh, interesting because it's very conservative. So um, estimates don't, con don't include tourism, which will likely take some time to resume in full force. So if they apply um, those numbers, conservative numbers, then the top line sales forecast is over $1.1 billion for the first complete total year of sales. I expect some big numbers from the Big Apple, maybe some Apple-wrapped uh, terpene-infused pre-rolls or something. Washington State also has a lot of apples, so maybe we can collaborate, come back to the Talking Hedge and find out more. With that, we're going to roll this one up. I am Josh Kincaid. This is the Talking Hedge. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, or don't, and I'm out. Don't forget to smash that like button on your way out and check out these other videos that we've got.